Oh, gosh, are we on part five or six? I think it's five. Might be six. You're still with me? Thanks for, thanks for hanging around. Uh, uh, okay, we're still alive, doing good. We got one more extra life, that's good. I don't know what's coming. Uh, I haven't been in the, I haven't been to the cave. Um, because I've got the sweater, which helps me stay alive. Jason won't kill me as fast, I guess, ish. I think even in the original NES game, the backgrounds do move at uh, different rates. So that's that was a cool thing that the original game had. Okay, so now the cave is cave is the last place I have to go. I guess I think. I'm getting killed for a jar of jelly. Anytime. We're good. It's good. We're still alive. Move forward. Fully loaded. Let's go. I guess since I've got the torch, I can see some stuff or what it is. The flashlight. Ah, it feels like a big jump. That's a path I think I can take. Scratch an itch. Um, I'm in the cave. Cave of wonders. Or horrors, or however you want to look at it. And, um, I don't know. I'm trying to make my way through this. Uh, he's my limit. Okay, Jason's come and gone. I don't, I guess it's just a matter of poking around and seeing where things are. I don't know what else to do. Let any of them get away, because if they do, they'll come back. Not sometimes they come back, they always come back. For more. Don't even forget their keys, all that good stuff. Okay, got, got the void. Voids. Oh god. Okay. Should be using my flame. My torch weapon. Flame. Sounds like a conjure. Um. I haven't played a lot of the new games. If you don't know the truth, I haven't really played a whole lot of the new games. I have this computer that's capable of it now. And maybe I'll finally play the uh, Castlevania Lords of Shadow games. Finally. Uh, one thought I had. I could, uh, think about. I'm being super cautious. There we go. Got that. I work like the holy water in Castlevania. On my age or roots or whatever. Um, I'm talking about 
I haven't played, uh, I haven't played uh, the newer games, and I don't know if I will. I mean, I like playing these older games and stuff, and... And, um, or these, I like, there's so many people redesigning the old games or making new games with the old format, so that's really cool to me. Um, this, this guy here, Ed Finley, made this great game. Um, I'm really looking forward to his Castlevania 2 remake. I'd like to play that. I hope James Rolfe of the Anger Video Game Nerd plays it. And here's a few different ones out there. Um, yeah, I don't think I want to jump down there. I guess I'm gonna go left. I think I've eliminated all the enemies. Um... I remember the days when I called it a system and not a console. That's a funny, fun fact from my own personal experience. Leap of faith. There we go. Okay, one way to go. Okay, now I've found Jason. I got him. Is it over? Just beat the game, ladies and gentlemen. Are you with me? Uh, I guess I go out the cave door. Get in the van. And as with all horror-related things, all is well, right? Or is it? Original music, nice. You have finally managed to defeat Jason. But is he really dead? We're not telling. So oh. well, 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 well. That'll be an interesting sequel. That would be an interesting sequel right there, Ed. So, there you go. Make it happen. Make it so, number one. And that was Friday the 13th Revisited. Thanks for sticking around if you did. Um, uh, Ed Finley's website, Retro Gamer 3. Uh, just Google Retro Gamer 3 or Ed Finley, Friday the 13th. Check out the other games he's got there. Um, remakes of old games. Uh, new little tweaks. I think you might like them if you liked the originals. Or maybe you'll like these more since they're better. Or maybe you'll not like these more since you already beat the originals and you're like, i already been there and lived that. So, whatever works for you. Have a good one, guys. Clicking it off. Here we go.